A man considered one of Louisville's most dangerous killers walked out of prison a free man. The Department of Corrections says Ricky Kelly served out his sentence and was released yesterday. Kelly was indicted for eight murders but never went to trial in any of those cases. He struck a plea deal in 2017 for the 2005 death of La Juante Jackson. Kelly faced the death penalty in the case, but the plea deal called for him to serve just 10 years in prison. Kelly's release has left many people wondering, how does this happen? WDRB's crime and courts reporter Jason Riley joins me now to break down this case a little bit more. Jason, give us a more in-depth look at who Kelly is and why he's considered to be such a notorious killer. Ricky Kelly was charged with eight murders, including government witnesses. The Commonwealth attorney at the time, Dave Stingle, said he was one of the most frightening people that he'd ever met. Um, however, they ended up dropping the case for fear that more witnesses may get killed. So they send it to federal court where it's harder for uh, names to be released on one count of murder, but still a key witness was murdered. So Kelly ended up going back to state court on one murder case, but got it amended down, and he was facing the death penalty, but got it amended down to manslaughter, uh, you know, 10 year sentence. and. 85%. So can you explain in a little more detail about how Kelly was able to get released already? It was a 2017 plea deal, 10 years to serve, and here we are in late 2023, and he's already out. So for those at home who may not know, how does that work? Well, he wasn't, you know, he wasn't conv convicted of murder. He was convicted of manslaughter, and there was a lot of uh, people angry about that at the time. But prosecutors felt they wanted to get something on this guy. They didn't have a lot of physical evidence, so, so they got him for manslaughter, and that has an automatic serve out of 85, uh, 85%. And he had already served some time from his original arrest, some time in jail, so that counted to go along with what he, he has served now. And he's basically just served out. So nothing special has happened here. The, the statute, the law has been followed and he's served out now. He's a free man and nothing, nothing different was done uh, to get him out earlier. All right, thanks Jason. You'll find more of our coverage on this case right now on WDRB.com.